Good things come in small packages, and no one packs more goodness into bite after bite after bite than Pure Fections. This small Quincy chocolate shop has amassed a big following thanks to the unique treats created by sisters Lisa Trafoni and Christina Barkas. We do everything a little bit different. I've always loved chocolate, and chocolate's my thing, but I, we wanted to kick it up a notch and combine different ingredients, different ideas, use different packaging, and just make everything a little bit different on top of being delicious. When you come into our store, you're not going to see the typical things that you see everywhere else. Everything we do here, we do different. Whether it's our peanut butter fluff cups or even our turtles, we do it different. Every creation is made by hand in small batches, using gourmet Belgian chocolate to make addictive items like salted caramel cups, beer nut bark, chocolate dipped cookies, and habanero sea salt discs. Our newest one, the habanero sea salt disc. Salt and chocolate, always an underlying theme, but I love a good kick and spice. It just pops in your mouth. I mean, it, the taste when you put that in, combined with the chocolate and the salty habanero, it's amazing. These sweet sisters have been making sweet treats here for six years, but for Christina, chocolate has really been a lifelong obsession. My addiction to chocolate started when I was a little kid. Lisa was actually selling chocolate bars for her school. I remember taking the whole box of bars and hiding in the closet and literally eating every single one. And they were all about this big. Needless to say, I was six years old, but someone had to pay for those bars and it wasn't me. These days, Christina can have all the chocolate she wants and Lisa says you should too. Chocolate makes you feel good, so why not eat it? And joining us now is the purely delightful co-owner of Pure Factions Chocolate, Lisa Trafoni. Now, uh, Lisa, you have uh, probably 50 of the most ridiculously over-the-top chocolate items I've ever seen in my life at Pure Factions. But i got to ask you about a few that are just way off the charts. I'm going to start with the marshmallow peanut butter cup. Now, explain how this thing is made and, and what makes it so incredible. Well, the best thing about this is... Remember when you were little and you would uh, take out the Wonder Bread and the peanut butter and the fluff and <laughs> yes. make that great sandwich, sure. you know, you waited to go home for? Well, we decided let's eliminate the bread, <laughs> add the best chocolate in the world, <laughs> fill it with some fluff and peanut butter. It's fantastic. It brings back those childhood memories with a little twist. Yeah, and when you bite into these things, I mean, you're right, because it's kind of more on the gourmet side, and that, that chocolate has, you know, a Reese's peanut butter cup is like all kind of soft, but this, you, you kind of feel the different textures, right? Yes, you get the fluff, you get the creamy chocolate, and then we, you know, put a little marshmallow and nut on top for the little extra crunch there for you. It's fantastic. People come into our store, and they're like, is that peanut butter fluff? Yeah. And we're like, yeah, that is. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. Now, you have so many different chocolate items. And I know a lot of people, they've gone to a local chocolate shop or a gourmet shop, and they see chocolate turtles. You know, that's, that's a favorite of mine. And you guys do something kind of similar, but definitely kind of to the next level. Uh, what do you call them, first of all, and then explain how these are made? Okay, we call them a tataruga. 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 And that is the Italian word for turtle. Uh huh. And so what we do is we take the nuts and we take a really good local beer mm -hmm. and we combine them. We add some spices. You know, like if you're, you're sitting at a bar and you're eating the nuts and the beer? Yeah. We made it easy for you. <laughs> we mixed it together, add some creamy caramel chocolate, one hand it, you're going to love it. I'm right. telling you, these turtles, we get people coming in, they're like, I've been eating turtles my whole life. This is it. And you have we them in different, different styles, right? We do. Well, we do have, um, you know, you can have it in the milk chocolate, the dark chocolate, the white chocolate, whatever you prefer. It's the best chocolate. Yes. Guaranteed. Now, you, I, I know that's certainly true. And all the, all the Perfections chocolates mm -hmm. all made with that kind of gourmet, handmade chocolates. Now, let's talk about baked goods for a moment, okay? Mm -hmm. You go to a bakery. Uh, like, my wife loves cupcakes. My kids love cookies. My, my personal favorite baked good in the world is a brownie, like a perfectly made chocolate fudgy brownie. But you guys do something which is a little <laughs> bit more ridiculous than just a brownie. Yes. You call it a brownie pop. And by the way, this thing weighs about a pound. So I explain the brownie pop. Well, this is a really cool treat because <laughs> it is my mom's recipe yes. so it's a childhood recipe it's a fudgy brownie with the best frosting mm. so who doesn't love a brownie with frosting no of course and then you take that brownie with frosting you put it on a stick yeah. and then you double dip it in in the chocolate <laughs> oh my god it, you're in heaven you're in heaven it's so it's it's amazing so we grew up with that and it's nice to be able to share it with people people come in they're like what's that 
Yeah. <laughs> well, I can't believe that anyone would actually get one of these gigantic brownie. I mean, do people come in just off the street and they get one and start gnawing on it? Or I know you you, you do smaller versions too, right? We do. We have the smaller <laughs> versions for those people who aren't daring enough. But there are those that are daring, and I know a few people who have been able to eat that in one sitting. So. Yeah. Those are those are some wacky people that you yeah. hang out with, by the Crazy. way. Crazy. I don't know if they're all members of your family or their <laughs> customers, whatever it is. No, smaller. Okay. Now, of course, the the item that really kind of put perfections on the map that made you famous. You serve it at the Phantom Gourmet Food Festival every year, and it's like a huge hit. It's called the P squared C squared, which is certainly a, a wacky name, but this might be one of the most incredible chocolate experiences I've ever had. So what's the story behind this thing? Well, the P squared C squared was an invention creation of my sister. Yes. One day she was in the shop. It was a little slow that day, and she decided she was craving. So she took <laughs> all her cravings. You know, you take the potato chips, and you take the caramel, the peanut butter, and the chocolate, and she put it all together, and she created this P square C square. This has become, for us, the go-to item. People are addicted to this. And what's great is that we're known across country for this. People know what P square C square is, and that is so cool. And it, it's just you bite into it. You get the salt, the sweet. It's amazing. I mean, just the fact that there's caramel and some kind of potato crisp inside of chocolate, I'm telling you right now, it sounds <laughs> weird, but trust me when I tell you, you absolutely have to try it. You can only get it at Pure Fections. They are at 102 Franklin Street in Quincy, and you can also order them online at purefectionschocolate.com.